You're very welcome. It's Ashling Mooney and this is your Angel Boot Camp. And we're at the Fairy Woods. And I'm just going to take you on a little tour of the fairies. Here we have uh, the head fairy here, Stug. The head fairy of the wood. And that's his house there. And this is the fairy wood in Corkin Park. And today, your Ranger Boot Camp, we're going to connect with the fairies and elementals. So I thought I'd give you a little tour of Corkney Park Fairy Woods. Beautiful fairies on every single tree. There we go. And you know, connecting with the fairies is as simple as just finding a place in nature. They're nature angels. They care for every single tree, branch, leaf, flower. In our environment, they really care strongly about the environment, fairies. And part of their mission is to wake us up and to help us to, to reconnect with nature so that we can, um, we can improve the planet, improve the air that we breathe, improve um, life on this planet for everyone. There's the fairy Bloom, lives in that tree, her little house is up on top there and she helps this flower fairy helps flowers in spring and summer to bloom it's a beautiful beautiful garden and here we have luna one of my favorites luna luna is the moonlight fairy she's cloudless nights are her favorite so there's this fairy here there's lots of beautiful little fairies that live in this forest lots of elementals that big tree over there is one of my favorites and so one of the ways that you can connect with the fairies is to go to a place in nature that you love you know a nice place in nature or even if you just have a plant at home a nice plant that you like and um, if you can't get out but really get getting out into some part of nature um, makes it much easier to connect with the fairies i hope i'm not too going too fast here that's a beautiful tree. This is one of my favorite trees. Look at this tree. She is fabulous. And the angel we have here, the little fairy we have here is Twinkle. This fairy can make anybody smile. So there you go. <laughs> beautiful, I love this tree. It's a very, very ancient tree with huge roots. So if you think about this space, this is, this is a, the, the, the fairy post box where you can put letters. But we put my daughter's uh, soother in there when she was giving them up and the fairy left her sweets and there's a little picnic area there where you can and there's lots of other fairies so basically one of the easiest ways i'm going to go back to this tree because i think i have so much power I just connect let you see the roots so one of the easiest ways to connect with the fairies is, is to get out in nature to connect with the beauty of nature um, there's little animals, there's probably a fox or something down there. There's a big huge burrow at the back of this. So there's animals living in this tree as well. So one of the ways to connect is to get out into nature. The, the, the fairies will come and will ask you to do something in your life um, um, to help them. So I'm going to try and turn this camera around. Can I do that? No, I can't turn it around. Okay. So one of the ways that is to get out into nature, I'm going to repeat myself, sorry. Uh, so we're going to take a deep breath. We're going to take a nice breath wherever you are. Take a nice breath. And we're going to just ask the fairies to come into our lives today. And what do they have to say? What piece of information or advice can the fairies give you? In your life and the messages that are flooding in for me and for all of us are to have some fun to lighten up to appreciate nature or even that appreciation can increase the power of nature and um, increase the health of our environment just by showing appreciation to the beauty of nature around us what else fairies what else would you like us to know and the fairies have an assignment for each of us today so 
for me, my assignment is I have to go and buy some product for the bathroom that I have been putting off. It's run out and I need to buy some product which is environmentally friendly rather than the usual bleaches and toxic materials that we can put in down the toilet and in the bathroom. So that's one little assignment, a funny assignment that I need to do today. And another one is they're telling me that they're very happy that I cleaned the garden. My garden was full of there was a lot of plastic and, and bits of paper that I had I had um, come into the space. So and I cleaned that up last week. So the angels, the, the angels and the fairies have a little assignment for you today. So just let us know what your assignment is that can make this environment, this world, a better place for every one of us. And share it in the Facebook group. I hope you enjoyed this little visit to the fairy woods today. Mind yourselves, and I will see you tomorrow.